Anyone watching these Skylanders reviews knows that you can buy Skylanders figures to play as the characters in the game, but did you know that you can buy an entirely new level? There's actually a couple of these. This is the Skylanders Pirates Seas Pack, which comes with the pirate ship, as well as Terrafin and some other stuff. Annoyingly, you can't run around the game as a giant pirate ship trying to kill hull people. And by people, I mean cute anthropomorphized animals with elemental powers. Portal Master, your adventure now takes an unexpected twist to the pirate seas. Cha-ching, seriously, Pink Floyd's money should start playing when you begin this level. Marketing brilliant, so what do you get with Pirate Seas? As you just saw, you do get a well-detailed pirate ship figure, uh, like, statuette thing. Which is actually pretty cool. You just place it on the Portal of Power once and you're good to go. Then you take it off and put whatever Skylanders you want to play the level with back onto the Portal of Power, or else you get sucked into the Portal of Power and uh, trapped inside Castle Grayskull. Skylanders of the Light Island are stronger in this zone. Ride the lightning with Zap! And he brings justice for all who get in the way of his now upgraded Electro Bolt water execution thing. I find the whole Skylanders concept pretty cool. Buying new figures makes complete sense. I mean, you couldn't play He-Man with just one figure. What was the point? He-Man would be bored. You had to give him Skeletor to fight or Tila to covet. And of course you couldn't stop there. You needed Castle Grayskull, Battle Cat, and, and whatnot. The same with Skylanders, but personally the figures give you more bang for the buck than the Pirate Seas level. You get a level which isn't even one of the more exciting ones, and it forces you to play the old-school memory card game most of the way through. Swords! Seriously, three-year-olds could do this one. There's also some new hidden areas and elemental areas to explore. I'm playing here as Treebeard, I mean Stump Smash, gathering a new hat to increase some kind of power and definitely look more fashionable. With this level, you also get a ridiculous storyline and creepy cats with cleavage. It it's Pirate Seas, but fortunately this gift pack also comes with Terrafin, watch my review of him, and Pirate Booty. If you want her back, you'll need to beat me poop deck. I'm, I'm sorry, what was that? Oh, each of the card games has a different name, that's right. But they're all memory, remember? Memory, anyone? Do you remember? Or have you long since killed those brain cells, parents? <laughs> it's Pirate Seas, which is alright. You get the nice looking pirate ship, you get some new stuff in the level. But what I like most about the Pirate Seas Adventure Pack is Terrafin, the figure. Yars! Revenge. It's Pirate Seas for Skylanders Spyro's Adventure. I'll see you back here in the next part of the Skylanders Review. Meeting.